Hey there, everyone, this is our album dog game. Last time we went to town, uh, by the way, we're in England, because <laughs> Big Ben lives here. That's a big bone, not a Big Ben, you idiot. Do dogs have green eyes? Is that a thing? I don't know. Here's a bat. Oh, hi, puppy. Oh. My name is Yvonne. You got a cold? <laughs> you do. Gesundheit. Thanks. I think I've got a bit of a head cold. Mm-hmm. Hey, Yvonne, I need to get to the top of this tower That's to contact right. the barking chick. Can you give me any advice? Oh, sure. I know this place like the back of my wing. As you make your way up, I'll drop in every now and then with some advice. So... Okay. Thanks, Yvonne. So just like Fidget. Anyways, press select apparently and you can switch actor immediately. Yeah, and I will be playing as Frankie Muniz from now on because, I don't know, I mean... Oddball the albino, like, yeah, they're fine, but I don't know, they're, they're not Frankie Muniz. Like, who would uh, escape uh, the chance to play as Frankie Muniz at any time of the day? I don't know what any of that means. Alright, so here they're on Sagan Blink Castlevania. We are in the clock tower. We're looking for things. I'm gonna park at this blimp and it's gonna crash. A good time was had and here's a stake. It's floating there. Air stake. Did that blimp not drop any bones for me? See, I hunt down every one of my enemies so that I may devour their bones, but um not here apparently. Well, it's because you had meat inside of you instead. Oh uh, uh, man, you can't trust a blimp, you know? You destroy it, expecting bones, instead you get a meal? Uh, I mean, sure, it sounds like a great deal, but think about the implications. I don't know what they are. So that's why I need you to think about them for me. Alright, so here we can go here on this ledge, and we can do an awkward jump and miss! Oh boy! But there was a one-up there, so maybe that's the game saying, No, you don't need to come here, but you can, and if you do, right? Yes. Yeah! Hmm. Do you think, like, there's like a, a bit of an air stall when you jump and spin? But you do get some distance, like maybe you do like, uh, Okay, yeah, that worked out. Uh, and yeah, the more I'm here, the more I think... I'm not supposed to. We're gonna get there from another angle. Well, now I know! Here we are! Either one's dog, Alvin dog, dog, dog. I'm in this place. The music is so spooky. That bone was flickering, and someone put a small little arrow here. Just for me. Uh, right. And here there's another arrow. Also for me. Here we're doing platforming. Alright, here we go. Playing banjo. I played that earlier this year. And here you want me to go to the side. The camera, not the best in the universe. I mean, like, it does its job. And I guess, in terms of camera, I'm expecting people to go beyond their job, which seems kind of rude. All right, here's Bouncy Man Face Balloon. So, be ready. Ready your pancake batter. All right, bark at it, bark at it, bark at it until it dies. And you can select its bones and then roll inside this box. Hey, box! Which way to the bathroom? Oh, well, you're a dog. Anywhere is a bathroom. Just don't think about it. All right, here we go. Why are there bones inside this clock? It's the Necro Clock. It's got a sticker. Don't know why. I guess I did that sequence without death. Uh, I mean, you don't die. You just fall off. This is a like a whole area. Maybe I should like get my sniffer out now just to make sure. All right, the game's like no, 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 no. My sniffer never lies. Into a brand new area where there's a bird checkpoint. Going to destroy this helicopter. Maybe. That, oh yeah, there we go. Wow, it took a while. Then bones are appearing everywhere. Yeah, bones. Bones are great if you want to eat marrow and very little else. That is my understanding of the world. Alright, so let's go over here where we can encounter a bouncy man, but I have no means of getting 
to it, so I'm gonna have to find another way, I guess. Alright. Yeah, here too. It's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. And you see, you know, the box kind of phasing through life. Uh, phasing through life and speed and sound. There's a bat right there, could see it through Ride the ground. The swinging clock pendulums across the room to make it to the exit. And make sure to explore the hidden rooms on the side. I appreciate your enthusiasm, Sneezy the Bat. That's not your name. I did not make any effort to remember your name. I'm sorry. I'm a real jerk of a dog. I, whoa, oh boy, okay. There's a... There's a... It feels very Mario Sunshine, for lack of a better word. Uh, where, like, I'm not quite sure what's the surface I'm allowed to be on. But yeah, you have to move on it, though. Because, yeah, because, like, you're not going to stick to it. Which is realistic. Alright, bite sound effect. Oh, then you jump on the side. Make sure to explore the hidden rooms. I'm hidden. You're a room. Wow, it's really bright out here. Is it? I don't think it is. I mean, compared to inside a crate, I guess. Oh my gosh, we're bombing a dog. Who would do that? All right, buddy. That's right. I blew you up. And a bone appeared way at the other end of the room. Super weird! And yeah, I have to do that again on the other side, like, fight a guy. So look forward to that. It's gonna look very similar. I don't know, I... I think the music... It's trying. There's something going on here. Alright, so, here. That's right, can't deny that. Then you go like, uh, -huh. then you're like, here. Your helicopter. Helicopter. I barked at the. I got saw blade by the helicopter? Jeez, okay. Oh, there's the bone that was driving the helicopter, possibly. I don't know. Do you think there's gonna be more bones appearing somewhere? Gotta get down the chute. Sticker! And that guy just slopped his face against the ground. What an idiot. Anyways, one day maybe it'll die. Are you dead? Deflated? Here you go. Your deflation has been complete. This is how I relate to you. Uh, okay. Well, that looks to be what's going on here. Looking forward to having to retrace the level to look for bones and redoing the play. Ah, it's fine. Platforming is absolutely fun. It's actually pretty fun. Alright, so there's bones on the other end here. So you have a mighty leap on the pendulum. Then you slip off. Yeah, you have to do it. It's part of the rules. Dog rules. Find a pendulum, you slip on it. Alright, so. Here you go. Yeah. Don't be afraid to, like, try to aggressively walk and then aggressively fail. You don't get punished. The punishment is time, and it's not even that. Saw so good. Alright, let's do that again. Here we go. You can press the bark button if you want. Don't won't do much, but it's fun. Alright, so transition. Here we go. I'll keep walking. And here we go. There's a stake there. I did get saw bladed by a helicopter, which is fun to think about. No! I wanted to sniff! Alright. Back in one shot. Yeah. See, so it's kind of interesting because lower down it says to go there, but up here it says to go there. Very confusing. Uh, here it's very clear. We go here against the camera. Oh man, staircase leads to bone. So 40 and 2. So yeah, we're uh, we are not anywhere close. Checkpoint bird right here. I woke him up from his parrot nap. Good. Uh, this looks supremely dangerous. All right, let's hitch a ride, I guess. Don't worry about it. Ride hey. the piston up to the top of the room. Uh-huh. Try jumping when you get close to the top. Okay. Looks like fun. Looks like you'll die. That looks like fun. No, wait, there's there's bones down here. So we're not doing that right now. We gotta run around. Look around this spot and destroy this clown. It's not a clown, it's a punching bag thing. Look at that, you bark at it and it dies and a bone appears behind it somewhere. What? And then I thought I saw like something white that could have been the bone, but it wasn't. What was it that I saw? No one will know. Oh, there's another one of these! Just hopping around. Oh man, watch out. The bone appeared right there. 
don't despair. Don't worry about it, okay? Don't. This is a worry-free area. Well, that's not... You know what? I'm not gonna tell you what to do. Alright, so... Oh, is there multiple pistons? Looks like it. So, yeah, there, you're there, but there might be something here. There isn't. But there might be. But there isn't. But there might be. Alright, this is like another piston? Okay, there's a helicopter. Helicopter Jim! He blew up! Oh, that Jimmy. We all knew he would blow up one day. But we didn't think it'd be literally. So I don't know where I am or why I'm there, but I'm going to do a jump, get a sticker, and my head through his head. Yeah, don't, well, don't, this is just a dog thing, don't worry about it. Just ask any local dog and they'll tell you the joy of just driving your own skull through another one's skull. It's, it's, it's just a family thing, you know? That's just, that's just how you show intimacy within strong familial bonds. I barked at his helicopter and a bone appeared. Yeah, what about it? You got any problems with that? I don't know where I am or where I'm going. I guess I'm going to go there where there's a door. Makes a lot of sense. All right, there's the piston I'm going to ride. Church bells. It makes sense. We are inside Big Ben. Like, this is how it is. Like, you can take the tour. There's guys there. All right, helicopter gem. I ha oh, no, it's a blimp. All right, mark out the blimp. It blew up, I think. It sure did. Okay. And there's the bone that you drop. How melancholic. Now I'm gonna go over here. Yeah, bone left somewhere on the floor. There's a balloon. I'm gonna bark at it again. Oh, I never bark at that one. The first time barking, third time napping. My number is super weird. Like it ends with a nine. I am gonna have to retrace my step and it's gonna be terrible, but you know what? That's okay. That's totally fine. Things are terrible, it's fine. Where am I going? Not here. Oh, here, okay. All right, uh, uh, yeah, I missed it. I missed a piston, it happens. All right, press the button, when you press the button. What's my health? Just show me, just show me that health. Like, just show it to me. Just have it on screen. We don't need to see to have uh, that lower corner free of HUD elements at all times. Yeah, I don't know, maybe that's just me. Alright, there's an helicopter. Do you know what you do with that? Yeah, you bark at it until it crashes. That's the way you want to teach your dogs, huh? You see a helicopter, bark at it, incredible amount of damage. That's right, that's what it's all about. Alright, so here we go, we're running on the swimmy piece of wood. Now we're going up this ramp. Yeah, that's accurate. I don't know what's going on there. Look at that, I'm barking at you. You're trying to headbunt air, but it ain't not happening. Hamburger bun. Those are the best. Maybe. I mean, if you like hamburger. You can do without a burger. That's pretty good. Alright, yeah, sink to the ground. That's what all the cool kids are up to now. Ground sinking. That's right. Alright, so. Oh, there was Krilla's face on a balloon. I just noticed. What a piece of detail. I mean, eat this meat. There we go. Got a bean back. Eat a meat, get some bean. That's how it goes. It's science. Science is beautiful and tasty. All right, so, uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on here. We're doing platform. All right. Mighty leap. Mighty leap. Hey, look at that. Look how mighty my leaps are. All right, I did it. Dog. Yeah, he just goes. Where'd he go? He's just gonna jump right down the clock forever. All right, the forever clock zone dog, jump, air, machine. All these qualifiers, it's almost tiresome. All right, turns out these guys are just unable to do anything if you just bark consistently and insistently, more importantly. Here I am, just, oh look at that, bat's like, whoa, check it out, it's me, I'm the bat. Jump toward the red counterweight when it reaches the bottom of its cycle. Yes. Look around the room as you're traveling up and down. Okay. And you might find some cool stuff. Fantastic. Look, I'm aware that this game that is designed for a certain age range, but I still think it's funny that it's just basically explaining basic platforming stuff, you know? It's not even like unique to here or anything, it's just 
You're playing a video game. These are probably things you should consider. I don't know. I mean, I had to learn all these sad truths without the bat telling me all about it. Living the hard life. Mighty leap! Whoa! I'm gonna talk to you while we're riding. Jump to the yellow counterweight. No. From there, you might be able to rescue one of your brothers. Ridiculous. You can also jump on the green counterweight if you want to head toward the exit. Never. I feel like I'm, I'm self-contradicting myself here. So where's the yellow counterweight? That guy? Yeah. Whoop! Well, all right. Might be a game for children. My spatial perception is still terrible. I'm an idiot, stupid, bad player. There's no way around it. You have to take your time. That's fine. Just kind of go. Oh boy, that felt not great. great. No. Now, make sure you explore the ledges that you can reach from this counterweight. I, I've been doing that. When you're finished, come back here and then jump back to the blue counterweight. I mean, I think I've been doing that, but I am missing like a lot of them still. When I get my paws on Cruella, I'm gonna. That's a pretty sweet reference. And also, I'm missing a dog. Like, I'm not seeing. Anything else, really? All right, well, let's go on a counterweight, you know, which is this thing, this big cylinder. Uh huh? Doesn't move that much, but you know, you can get access to here. So there's bone there. How would I get there? From blue? Can I do this, Jim? Whoa! I could. All right. Sweet. I did that terrible, frightening jump for a single bone. Then I'm kind of stranded. This is very strange. Right, can I make it back there? I can. I'm surprised. Alright, so that leads to the end. Well, I don't know. Might lead to the end of the level or just end of this section. Let's find now out. jump off onto that ledge and you'll find a way to get to the purple counterweight. From oh. there, you'll find a way to the exit which will take you closer to the top of Big Ben. Something oddly super condescending about everything going on here. I don't know. It's just like the very, very direct... There's something, I don't know. There's something about the nature of these instructions that bother me. But I, I, I can't formulate what. Anyway, that's probably the purple. Because it's purple on top. No, that's normally how words work. How's my health? Good. So 79. I'm missing one somewhere. I'm gonna have to return and redo all this. Uh, it's fine. Yes. Bird. Helicopter. Yeah. Prepare. It's a sound. I got a face on you, helicopter. Did you know that? I uh, did not. It, it, it went, the, the knowledge made itself destroy. I'm pretty sure. That's how it works. All right. So that no, that's the thing you're trying to bomb me with. I'm trying to bark you down. No nope. sonar weapons. Eventually, maybe. Like how do? Uh, boy, you're annoying. All right. So if I go here and I lose the ability to see where I am, in relationship to this sea boat, air boat, sky boat. Yeah. Okay. There we go. I did it, and a bone appeared here. We did it. Where I am in time and space, here and now. Oh, hi. Use the spinning gears to cross the gaps. No. You almost made it to the top of Big Ben. Why are you laughing at me? And uh, I can't help but notice you're not warning me about floating Medusa heads. Uh. Okay, well, yeah, that, mm-hmm. Like, I just do not have the camera there, I feel like, to make this work. Uh, maybe I could put it sideways? Maybe that's the way to go. In which case, it is very hard for me to align myself because, I repeat myself, I have no 3D spatial awareness when playing video games. Like, I just cannot perceive that at all in this game. This is why I'm always, always just behind and I'm doing full-size jumps. 
uh, okay, I know I'm aligned. Doesn't matter. Like, when I'm- when, when the camera's behind, I don't have that issue. It's super strange. Alright, okay, so nothing seems to be going here. Yeah, I'm gonna bark at you until you die. Like, you can't even attack, it looks like. You leave a state. Well, that's a mistake. You see what I just did there? I- 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 I rhyme the word with itself, basically. Uh, you add miss to state, and then you get mistake. I don't know why. What's the etymology? Probably completely unrelated. That's normally the case. Where am I, and what am I looking at? A valid question. Yeah, where am I? What is here? Just a button? Oh, okay. Mind control little uh, elevator device. Oh boy, that's violent. Stop it. Alright, whoa, oh, here we go. I ate a steak roll into this dog. Yeah, you're just at the top of a tower. Good luck. Have fun. In the city you don't know. <laughs> just kind of asking for trouble here. All right, so I'm gonna keep struggling, fighting with the camera. There we go. The struggle is a purpose, after all. Here we are. Yeah, chomp sound. Just bite down on that bone. There we go. Oh boy, we're redoing this a little bit. All right. I mean, maybe we'll go fine. I mean, I love this kind of platforming, but, oh, I do not feel in control. Alright, so all dogs, uh, heaven sent, but I'm missing bones, so as I thought, I'm gonna be retracing my steps and redoing a lot of the platforming, but you can dig through wood! Uh, never forget, you are inside of you a beaver. Or a termite. A little bit of both. Uh, Alright, well here's the trilogy of buried bone dust. Favorite trilogy of all time. So do you want me to go like over here or... Okay, well it looked like you wanted me to go like around there somewhere maybe? I don't know what you want. I don't know how to interpret this here. Um... Now you want me to go over here now? Okay, here! Right! Uh, this clearly marked area. Of course, I should have dreamt about that in a dream. I guess that's my fault. And here, in this location! Yeah, that makes a lot of sense, I agree. Alright, and what does the sniffer have to tell me now? Uh, over here in this door? Yeah, we're going to another area. Oh, there's the bone! It's just here! It was just here in a clock room in this weird little awkward blind corner that I just jumped over. Oh, that's... alright. I figured it'd be something like that. No, I figured it'd be a dig spawn, actually. That's even worse, because I, I could have gone that. I just, yeah, I just sailed over it. Alright! Let's rebeat the level. But it'll go a lot faster now that I'm not going for, like, every little tidbit. What's that? Sure. What? Squawk can let me skip the platforming due to his magic lightning powers on the ground. Uh, I mean, I appreciate it. I didn't see that coming. Well, thank you. This is really dizzying. <laughs> like, what is going on? Wait. Was I supposed to, like, jump off manually? Okay, we. Uh, let's wait until like, and I press the button. So you let me see, but I can't. But what? What? You know, this level is really interesting, because, like, you have some genuine, like, platforming challenges. And, you know, like, it's well-made, they're well-designed, they're interesting. But then you just have just the strangest, like, most condescending health 
to things that I don't know if they require help, honestly. It's very confusing. Alright, yeah, override that save. Here we go. 22%. Basically done. Oh, it looks like we're gonna have a boss, I'm assuming. Well, that's gonna be its own thing tomorrow, because today was clock day. And next time, uh, looks to be he versus helicopter. Yeah, dogs and helicopters are well known to struggle whenever both need to occupy the same territory. Look at that. So no, no dogs, no bones, uh, just the bones inside that one woman. All right, fair enough. We can handle that.